still haven't had back from Liam. He's probably with Becky. Do you think they're shabby? Definitely. going out together. I thought they were already seeing each other. No, they've been seeing each other for a bit, but now they're actually going out. Bill's such a player. I wonder how long that will last. He's all right. Bit of a pretty boy, though. Thought you guys were dead. How come you didn't text me back? We had to go off the grid. I smashed my phone so they couldn't use my GPS. My phone's out of battery. How did it go with your sister? No problem. You know Emma. She's just full of hot air. Has he said anything? Not a peep. He just sat there staring at us. Pretty weird. I didn't dare sleep. I don't trust Viv's not tying skills. Hey! I can't believe how tired I am. Did you bring any food? How can you think of food right now? We've been here all night. I'm pretty hungry too. Okay, let's get some supplies. We could do with tying the fella up a bit more securely. Sounds good. I could do with a second breakfast. I'll come with. Hang on, that's bullshit. You just got here. How about you stay and me and Viv go? It's cool. I'll watch him. You both go and bring back some food and some zip ties or something. Oh, yeah. Sure. Come on already. I'm getting hangry. Late one last night, then. What did you and Vivek talk about? You didn't mention anything about me to your sister last night, yeah? Why would I do that? Just, it was self-defence, yeah, and he's not dead or anything, so it's not even a crime, really. I'm not an idiot. I didn't say anything. It was Viv's idea to tie him up, and if you hadn't got stuck on that fence or whatever, we wouldn't even be in this situation. Did you and Vivek talk about what we're going to do about school? Screw school. It's the least of our problems. What are we getting again? Some stuff to tie the guy up with and some sort of weapon. Yeah. Uh, why don't you leave the talking to me? As if I would actually say it like that. Hi. Can I have a Stanley knife, uh, a roll of duct tape, and a bunch of double thick zip ties? <laughs> How old are you? Should you two be in school? It's a teacher training day. Mm, right. Wear your school uniform every day, do you? All right, you got us. We're bunking school. We're building a computer from scratch, and we need some zip ties to hold the cables together and the knife to cut it. Bravo. But you know you have to be 18 to buy a knife. What? You didn't know that? No. That went well. Oh, it's fine. I nicked all that stuff when we first walked in there, just in case. Oh, you little thief! Come on, let's not hang about. I'm not exactly thrilled about walking around town with all this murder stationery on us. Mr. Hughes. What are you two doing in? Why aren't you at school? Ah. Yeah. Uh, sorry, we're just running a bit late. Um, Becky, uh, wanted some company regarding a medical issue. 
Nothing serious, just a bit, you know, uh, personal. Right. Thanks, Donna. I take it you got permission to leave the school premises? I'll make a phone call to your form tutors to check, shall I? Donna? Hang on a second. Oh, for Pete's sake. Family problems? Look, I don't have time for this. Just get back to school and we'll talk about this another time. Too close. You've got crap chat, that's your problem. Piss off. I got us out of that, didn't I? Yeah, well done. Come on, let's just get some food and go back. Do you think it would be weird if I asked Vivek out? Whoa! Out of nowhere? Yeah, he's a sweetie. Would it be weird? I don't know. Might be a bit weird. Up to you. That's what I thought too at first. But opposites can attract, can't they? And I could use a good roll around. What's up? You've gone quiet. What? Don't be weird. What's going on? Sorry. Still feeling pretty tired. You're tired? I'm running on fumes here. Oh, we completely forgot to get Viv anything to eat. Oh, just don't mention it to him. He's probably forgotten anyway. Hey! Donna forgot to get you any food. Oi! No worries. Probably should head back anyway. I'll get food at home. If it's any consolation, we did manage to get hold of a box cutter and a bunch of cable ties. Okay. I guess we can time up a bit more securely. Okay, he's not going anywhere for now. Can we be sure he won't bust out of these restraints? Who knows what he's capable of? Yeah, but these are double thick zip ties. I really need to go. Me too. Need to figure out a good excuse where I've been on the way home. I'll walk with you. Donna, you okay staying here while we're gone? Yeah. You go get some sleep. We'll be back as soon as we can. I just need to make an appearance for Dad. Did he say anything while you were looking after him? Nope. I did try talking to him, but not a word. Hey, hot stranger. We're going now. Please don't eat our friend. Okay, see you guys later. Bye, Donna. Come on, Viv. <laughs> 